Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for your great support, always. I'm so grateful for your continued support to this channel. Thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen. Now, as you speak, the Kenya Conference of Catholic Bishops, KCCB, is coming out to reject William Ruto's donation yesterday, of course, in Soweto Catholic Church that he attended yesterday. Remember William Ruto donated almost to 5 million Kenya shillings in Soweto Catholic Church in Nairobi. And so the conference of Catholic, uh, of course, the conference of Catholic bishops, they are coming out to demand their church to return the monies that William Ruto donated in their church. I want us to read this letter. But before we do that, ladies and gentlemen, as you always do, ensure you like the video. When you like the video, you automatically support the work that I'm doing in this channel. Because sometimes you watch the video and you forget liking the video. So this is just a reminder. As you watch, ensure you like the video. I want us just to read the section where the letter says, In light of these directives and in adherence to the public fundraising appeals bill 2014 under section 10.2, it is deemed that any person who solicits or receives money or a benefit conducts a fundraising appeal, regardless of whether the representation made was direct or indirect. Such fundraising appeals require a permit in accordance with the bill. Consequently, the donations made to Soweto Catholic Church on Sunday 17th November 2024 are in violation of these directives and the law. These include the government of Nairobi's donation of 200,000 to the parish choir and parish missionary council PMC. The president's donation of 600,000 to the choir and PMC and of course 2 million for the construction of the father's house. These funds will be refunded to the respective donors. Furthermore, the promised additional 3 million for the construction of the father's house, as well as the donation of the parish bus by the president, are hereby declined. Politicians are most welcome to attend church for their spiritual nourishment, but they are encouraged to do so as ordinary Christians without leveraging their position for political gain. Yours in Christ service, Most Reverend Philip Agnolo, of course, is the Metropolitan Archbishop of Nairobi County. You can see the rubber stamp, a rubber stamp Archdiocese of Nairobi, rubber stamp reads 18th November 20. In other words, it is authentic. This letter is authentic and uh, has been verified. Now, Kenyans, yesterday William Ruto contributed 5 million Kenyan shillings. On the same note, Kindiki was in Kirinyaga and contributed 7 million, 5 million for William Ruto and 2 million for himself. I want to ask a simple question. It is, it is just the other day. Kindiki was made the deputy president. How much has he earned that is now making him to donate two million? In other words, I want to tell you this. The money that Kindiki Kituri was donating is not the money coming from his pocket. Regardless what he's saying, that in Sadaka, media musiende mutuaribu jina uko. But in real sense, this money is easy pesa. Ya William Ruto na Kindiki. Ini pesa yo, yenyu, taxpayers money. Hakuna pesa zinatoa kwa mfuko ya hii watu. You know? So, when you look at the money that Kindiki took in Kirinyaga, 7 million. Then when you look at the money that Ruto donated, for example, it was even in Soweto, Nairobi. I think he promised 2 million first, then 3 million. That makes 3 million. Then there is 600,000. Um for choir and uh, 
the so-called Parish Missionary Council, you know, then Sakaja donated 200,000. So according to the so-called the Kenya Conference of Catholic Bishops, KCB, KCPB, they are coming out to say this money. They never came out announcing any fundraising. You know? And again, what William Ruto did together with Kindiki was against the law. I want you to listen to Kindiki Kiture and William Ruto contributing their money yesterday. <laughs> Uyu mutu chama <laughs> Naitua Isanda yeah. Isanda Hame niambia muna jenga nyumba ya eh, Father hapa yes. Sindio yes. Na mimi ni mutu ya kujenga yes. Ma, Majenga affordable housing Majenga ingine Majenga ingine Hiyo ni kazi yangu Hiyo ya kujenga mimi na, naelewa yes. Sawa so, iyo eh, eh, nyumba ya father pale wana isanda, sawa. Utakuja kuniona Monday ama Tuesday, utakutafutia shilingi milioni tano. Kini, na hiyo pesa nasikia mkubwa hiyo pesa nitafuatilia yeah. ukipiga kona hivi kidogo utakutana na mimi <laughs> tumwa na sadaka ya rais ya shilingi milioni tano na watu wa press vile tumesikizana sadaka ndiyo tunatoa ambaye ya harambe we are waiting for the law na mimi niko na sadaka pia hata kama nilikuwa nimebeba sadaka ya mkubwa wangu na mimi nasindikisha hiyo sadaka na sadaka yangu binafsi ya shilingi milioni mbili So for me, whatever the Catholic is doing, this is the way forward. You want to affirm you kabisa because now William Ruto realized that you want to use money to persuade Kenyans or the church to support his agendas and policies. It is not going to be so. The way I told you, wake finya, tuna wafinya. Wake letter, tuna letter. And that is how now the, church, the Catholic church has decided to do. We are not going to accept any donation from you. You know, we don't want your money. We never requested for any, fund, uh, of course, uh, donation. If we do so, we will follow the rule of law. But again, William Ruth is just starting to move around the churches donating money, you know, which it is not accepted. So I think that is the way to go, ladies and gentlemen. What do you think? Drop your opinion at the comment section below. Otherwise, thank you so much because of your great support. Please consider subscribing, liking, commenting, and sharing this video. Bye-bye till you meet in another video.